go. Hey. 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 BVE returning for round two in stereo. Am I over here? Or am I over here? You'll never know. All right. Fuck. <laughs> I don't know what fucks up with your speed with your headphones, but they're just fading in and out. Don't eat a cupcake, you're gonna make a mess. I gotta have to clean it up. We have to vacuum anyway. Just help me out with this and eat yours. Oh, fucking damn it. I hate cleaning up after your goddamn messes. Well, we've been here a week and I've already cleaned up more here than I ever had in my entire life. That's not true, but it's it's a percent a large percentage. Okay, now that we're eating cupcakes, what's your line? I don't know, just... I'm not spending five minutes sitting in front of a microphone eating a goddamn it's cupcake. It's 47! Where should I start? Office, obviously. Oh, this is a good place. I decided to roll around the office today! <laughs> it's me, Vegeta! Hi, Mr. Fred. How are you tonight? What did you call me? You know my name. I am Super Vegeta. Blood Prince of all Saiyans. It's been a whole week and this is a really good cupcake. I get distracted. I'm still here. As always. You can't get rid of me that easy, Kakarot. Not even this cupcake can dissuade my quest. To destroy you. If you insist. I think we do all the top. Those are all ready. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Show stage! Because why the fuck not? We went to the show stage for some entertainment. Hello, faithful guard. Would you like to join me on the stage? But don't really, because I know what you do with the microphones, and it's real weird. Sure thing, Bruce Freddy! You remembered my name. <laughs> I've only ever had that kind of effect on women. I'm a robot! Toy Freddy and I spent the time singing karaoke! With our dicks. Gross. That's gross. 3.30 a.m. <laughs> I'm going to the main hall. <laughs> I went to the main hall next. God. Hey, my God! Hey, Freddy, how are you? We spent some time making casual pleasantries and cracking corny dad jokes, even though he was supposed to tell me a sad story and never did. What an asshole! I know. Toy Chica's made her return. Time to go to the brace corner and skip everything. Toy Chica again. <laughs> oh, I forgot she's back. She's she's back. God damn it. The sexy bird is bad. It's day 28, I don't give a shit. It's been four- It is safe to roll around the office to uh, get- It's me! I'm seeing no, down the floor! No! It's not it's these you. lines again. It's me! It's Vegeta. me too! It's both of us! I've ascended to a new plane. I have untapped power you could never imagine. What's I'm your new plane? I'm the Prince of Arceus. Is it a Boeing? 757. I think I've landed one of those on top of one of those before. Lies. Watch her just cause two series. Pixar didn't happen. I'm Vegeta. I'm not. <laughs> to the show stage. I hit over to the show stage to visit Toy Free. Salutations, guard. Care for a private show. Once Toy Freddy finished flashing his dick everywhere, we talked about our dreams for the future. No, I, I figured it would be you giving him a private show of you, sh of you shoving a dick in. Shoving your mic. Shoving a dick in his mic. Shoving yeah. a dick in his mic. <laughs> God, that would be as uncomfortable as the other way around. I, less, probably. Mics are very solid objects. Yeah, I know. But, like, you could hollow one out, I bet. It would be uncomfortable. Okay, if it's hollow, then sure, whatever. That's easy, easy stuff. Many would even find it pleasurable. I'm not one of those people. Me you either. probably are. I'm not. 
I don't believe you. You chose to go out for Rita's. <laughs> I think you just got stuck with him, to be honest. He thinks next day will be the, the main hit. Freddy wasted no time in coming to me when he saw me in the hall. <laughs> Youngin, I'm finally ready! Okay, I'm ready to listen. Freddy licked around. Mind coming with me? I don't want to be in their eyes while we talk. Their eyes? Does he mean the cameras? Sure! The girl's bathroom. Of course he'd lead you to the girl's bathroom. I hope all of the girl robots are in here for no reason. It's dark in here. Wow, he just blends into the background, doesn't he? Yeah. It's almost like he's Batman. It's almost like they didn't draw his outlines. <laughs> A long time ago- That's no. Not, right, not, nice try. Next time you'll get it. A long- <laughs> A long time- I was wrong. You heard it here first. <laughs> I was wrong. A long time ago in Fredmere's family wow. diner. You just combined the damn voices. I didn't think that was possible. <laughs> no, I'm just I'm I'm just gonna soak that in for a bit. Wow. That was impressive. Thank you. you should be a voice actor. No, I shouldn't be. I'm terrible at this. <laughs> you damn right you are. I was there, or at least a part of me was. Barney, Chica, and Foxy, they weren't around when the place was just a diner. Even I wasn't the same Freddy back then. After all, I was just Fredbear. Anyway, it's a little lazy, but back then I saw something horrible. I don't remember it vividly, but what I witnessed was brutality against Robot. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm wondering why you never went like, like, what was I going to say? Damn it, excuse me, I'll come to me later. Will it? Yeah. And then uh, I just uh, forgot how I opened it. Is it like a box? Or, it, was like, or... it was like, why you didn't introduce him as Macho Bear Freddy Savage? Why didn't I? Because I don't think of shit like that. That's why. <laughs> Just call me Bruce. Bruce Freddy. At the time, I was powerless to do anything about it, but that incident taught me one thing. Adults were dangerous. Had that been the end of it, I would have merely hung on to that guilt. Nothing more. It wasn't there, was it? At first, the pizzeria opened up, and then after the pizzeria opened up, I'd met the others. <laughs> is this when he goes into his Batman backstory and this is when he talks about how his parents died at the movie theater? Maybe. Wow, now I'm intrigued. Oh, because of the Batman killer? <laughs> BB will be retiring right now. Not actually. We had a great time, even if we didn't have as much control over ourselves as we do now. Though I never truly forgot deep down, the happier times helped me cope. That changed when it happened again and again. All I could do was watch. I don't understand. You couldn't do anything? No, not until afterwards. Why do you think our successes are so much more advanced than us? That they can move in ways that we never could. Identify bad eggs better than we could. You're, you're right about that, Torchica. She can move in ways you would never imagine. I'd do anything your girlfriend can do. <laughs> <laughs> and I can do it while doing the splits. And with my head backwards. And my mouth shut tight, you dirty bastard. Management probably told you that we can tell a good grown-up from a bad one. They can even think way better than we could back then. It's different now. Oh, that's a creepy face. Yeah, it is. After that night, the rest of us changed. He needs to brush his teeth. So the corpse smell? 
Had it never happened, us older models wouldn't be able to do what we can now. I have bronchitis. Think like we can now. Had I saved them, though. Freddy! Oh. He has AIDS. Oh. That don't make sense now. He died what do we AIDS. pick? Nothing but the first one. Nothing but the first one? Damn it. I realize I said as I said it, and I don't want to abide to it, because this is the only person we've gotten this far in. Yeah. Um, if there's anyone else, I'd say I would, I would have to go with it. I think the last one would be the best one. What happened to those kids is unforgivable, but don't let their sacrifice be in vain. You were given this miracle gift to protect children in the present. What if I can you can, and if you will, I don't think you'd be telling me this if you didn't want to push a do so. I'll give you that push, and any more pushes you might need. Push, push, another push, push you off a cliff. You can do this. Protect them, save them, protect and serve and save them. It's why you're still here. Save them money, save their lives, save the universe, save the world, save the environment, save the planet. You are Captain Planet, Toy Freddy, and only you are capable of saving the Earth. Do you understand me? If you think I can save the Earth, I believe you. I'm gonna do it. I'll save the Earth. Let's save the Earth. Let's save the Earth. Let's save the Earth. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? That may have been the greatest environmental speech I've ever heard in my life. That <laughs> <laughs> <It> was absurd. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> wow, okay. <laughs> With less. Uh... No, we're done. That's the end of that. <laughs>